Welcome back to the channel guys. My name is Gordon Frain. We are back with another video. Today we're looking at BitTensor Tau and what's been happening with the DTAU upgrade. As always, if you enjoy the content, please make sure to smash that thumbs up button below, hit that subscribe button as well, smash the bell notification icon, and don't forget to grab your completely free copy of The Rise of Bitcoin. It's linked below this video in the description. Grab the book for yourself, completely free, and let's talk about BitTensor. So BitTensor has been pulling back a nice, chunk over the past number of weeks we have had bitcoin pulling back to 91,000 and then rebounding up to 97.6 where we're sitting at today but when bitcoin pulled all the way down to 91 we had this spike here on the 3rd of february down with most of the old coin market <clears throat> bittenter was actually pulling back in the lead up to that anyway but we are looking like we're having a little bit of a bounce here. We're currently sitting at a price of $373 per token. As you can see, this bounce took place on the body of these candles around 315. So I'm hoping we can see us continue moving back up towards the 200 day simple moving average and reclaiming that over the coming weeks. If you're not familiar, guys, we've done plenty of videos about BitTensor on the channel. I will leave links for those other videos at the top of the screen here on this video. But BitTensor is one of the leading AI protocols in the entire crypto space. During this cycle, we're seeing a lot of growth, a lot of hype around subnets. And even more recently, this DTAU upgrade that is making some significant enhancements to the BitTensor blockchain. So lots of exciting stuff happening. And again, this is not just from a crypto perspective. We know that the largest corporations in the world, you've got Amazon, Facebook, Meta, um, Google, Microsoft, they're all fighting for a slice of the artificial intelligence revolution. And you're seeing leading blockchain protocols just like BitTensor charging ahead in terms of what's happening in the crypto space. We've done videos on render. There's been a whole host of stuff happening around the artificial intelligent agent narrative. And in my opinion, a lot of the stuff happening on subnets with BitTensor and now with this DTAU upgrade, the subnets are able to have their own individual tokens means that I think we're going to see a lot of growth and innovation with decentralized artificial intelligence over the next number of years. Again, the entire AI space is set to grow rapidly over the next five years as we approach 2030. And I do think BitTensor is positioned to capitalize on a lot of that if we jump into the artificial intelligence narrative over here on CoinMarketCap. You know, I would argue that BitTensor is indeed the largest AI token by market cap. I would not consider Near Protocol or Internet Computer ICP as inherently native artificial intelligence protocols. I know Near are leaning into AI a lot more recently. There's no mention of artificial intelligence in the Near Protocol white paper. You can check out some of the stuff we've done about Near Protocol. We dropped videos very recently on the channel. They seem to be very popular. Near does have a very um, a very cult-like following in a good way because I do think it's a very interesting protocol. But I still think BitTensor is the leading artificial intelligence token when it comes to the crypto space currently sitting at about 3.1 billion in overall market cap we did see its market cap much much higher just a couple of months ago when we had these peaks up at here around 5.25 billion in market cap by the time we got to the first week in December. And again, BitTensor was one of those tokens that actually ran uh, quickest in the immediate aftermath of those initial rate cuts back in September. So we got those rate cuts on September 18th and BitTensor led the charge along with the AI narrative, making big, big moves to the upside. So we had gains of around 128% in a 25 to 26 day period immediately after those initial rate cuts back in September. And then once again, on confirmation of the US election results, we had a nice leg up for BitTensor again, making moves, um, you know, 44% increase in the space of seven days, we then had a pullback. And as we went through into December, we had another gain of about 72% over a one month period. So when BitTensor runs, it really does run hard. And I do think we're going to see um, this AI narrative continue throughout this cycle. It's the first time we're really seeing a macro, macro narrative like artificial intelligence capturing the cultural awareness 
and capturing the attention of the largest corporations in the world, like I mentioned, all fighting for their slice of the AI pie, and that alignment of that narrative permeating into the crypto space with everything BitTensor is doing and all of the subnets is very, you know, it's amazing to see that kind of alignment of those narratives taking place. And I do think BitTensor, along with many other AI tokens, are going to ride on the coattails of this AI narrative and capitalize on it over the next six to 12 months. If we jump over here, I was just looking <clears throat> on Twitter and using Grok to figure out some of the key concepts around DTAO and this latest decentralized subnet upgrade on the BitTensor Tau network. Again, you can see it's clearly giving us new tokens for each individual subnet, which I think is very interesting, especially based on the amount of hype that we saw for AI agents back in December and January. I think a lot of the stuff that was happening on subnets for the past year or two is akin to what was happening with that burst of innovation for AI agents on protocols like Virtuals and AI16Z. So I think there's some upgrades that have happened with state staking and the staking mechanism. So when you're staking Tau now, you can exchange that Tau for the specific subnets alpha token. Again, updates for liquidity pools, emission distribution, market-driven evaluations, risk and rewards. So there's lots of updates happening on Tau. And I think the last time it got one of these serious upgrades, we did see a very nice increase in that price action as a result. So I'm excited to see what's gonna happen for Tau. Again, we did a price prediction on the channel a few weeks ago, guys. <clears throat> You can go back and check out that video yourself. We broke down some of the core concepts, the tokenomics for BitTensor as well. But what we came out at was essentially a bear case, base case, and bull case price target scenario, uh, getting us to about $2,100 in a bear case, about $4,300 in a base case, and around $7,200 in the most bullish case scenario. So what do you think about these price predictions, guys? Let me know. Drop me a comment below this video. I want to hear what you think about these price price targets and let me know do you want an updated price target as well we made this about a month ago so again i do like to come in and refresh and re-update these price target scenarios because the market is not static we're in a dynamic environment things change day over day week over week month over month certain tokens are going to outperform versus the rest of the market certain tokens are going to underperform versus the rest of the market. So we need to be thinking about where those price targets can get to. It is a moving goalpost and reevaluating these price targets on a monthly or bi-monthly basis is very, very important. Drop me a comment. Do you want an updated price prediction for Tau by the time we get to March of this year? Drop me a comment. Let me know. That is it for today's video, guys. The last thing I will mention is that today's video is sponsored by Femex, the most efficient crypto trading and investment platform. I will leave a link. It is a referral link in the description below this video for Femex. Come over and check it out yourself. Again, you don't have to use it. Do your own research. This is not financial advice, guys. Drop me a comment below. Let me know your thoughts on BitTensor Tau and the DTAO upgrade. Make sure to smash that thumbs up button on your way out the door. If you got any value at all in this video, please drop a thumbs up on it below. Hit subscribe, smash that bell notification icon. And like I said at the beginning, don't forget to grab your completely free copy of The Rise of Bitcoin. It's linked below the video as well. Grab it now down in the description and we'll catch you in the next one.